Howdy Fly fans! For those of you who are new to the Fly Box or don't know me very well, there's something you need to understand. I hate corn. Now, granted, I love to drink corn products, but I can't stand fishing with the stuff, and I haven't for four years. It's not the corn doesn't work, we've all seen the photo evidence to the contrary, but I just don't get it. All the salting and curing and dyeing, blah blah blah. People talk about kokanee corn recipes like it's gospel handed down from the gods. Well, back in April 2015, we released a video of my exact process for preparing corn for kokanee fishing. There's a link to the full video in the comments section of this YouTube video, but here's a snippet. That pretty much sums it up, although the full video is worth a watch. As you can imagine, we got folks all sorts of stirred up, and the comments flew thick and heavy, mostly in good fun. I say mostly because as the video was viewed and shared across Fly Fandom, I started to receive a couple of messages questioning the ethics around burning food while so many people in the United States go hungry. Now, we were just trying to have a little bit of fun. And it seems like you can't have fun these days without somebody getting offended. Not that I really care. But these wet blankets did have a point. People do go hungry every day. In answer to this, we're going to have ourselves a little photo contest. Head over to franksflybox.com under the general insanity section to view the rules. But the gist of it is for you to submit photos of you kokanee fishing with lures tipped with Berkeley maggots, mealworms, power bait, hell, anything but corn. And I'm going to want to see proof in the photos. Pretend your lure is taking a selfie or something. Um, ask a teenager how that works. And as much as it may warm my little heart to see you using Flybox products in your photos, you're free to use any lure you want, as long as it doesn't have that damn corn on it. Each entrant can submit two photos. And for each photo, Frank's Flybox will purchase or procure one unit of canned food goods. Photo submissions will last until 30 September 2016, and on October 1st, we're going to have a random drawing. The grand prize winner will receive $100 in Flybox gear, as well as a hat and sweatshirt, and they'll get to pick the food bank that receives the canned food goods that we procured throughout the year. Now, I appreciate it if you'd like and share this video on Facebook, but I'd also appreciate it if you got the word out to your friends and fellow kokanee fishermen. This is a chance for us to have a lot of fun, Possibly learn some new fishing techniques, get the jolly green giant the hell off our boats, and most importantly, do some good for our communities. Again, I highly encourage you to visit franksflybox.com to view the full rules, and I look forward to the videos and photos you all submit. Now what are you waiting for? Get out there and start fishing. I already have, and I'll see you out there. Cheers.